Hello, and welcome back to Coin Lady Channel. A rapid and significant spike caused the price of XRP to hit a new all time high of $9,861. While the exact amount of XRP that was sold during this anomaly is unknown, it is apparent that a profit was earned. This opens up some fascinating points of debate. Many people think the price of XRP was shown fairly and not due to a technological glitch. This idea is supported by Ripple's announcement that it plans to develop a private XRP ledger tailored for digital currency used by central banks. In a separate but connected development, the value of XRP unexpectedly increased to $50. By the end of the video, you'll understand that these inconsistencies, including the sudden appearance of another glitch after XRP is mentioned briefly, may be revealing XRP's genuine value. I've put in a lot of time looking into what causes these XRP surges and whether or not individuals may still complete transactions during them. Problems typically result in decreased income. According to the tweet, a sale was made at this location. Stay tuned until the credits roll, because we have some exciting news regarding XRP, your favorite cryptocurrency, to share with you. You can join my XRP giveaway by subscribing, liking the video, and sharing it with a few friends. XRP's intrinsic worth and practical applicability are inextricably linked to global reserve currencies, making price volatility an inevitable consideration as we get into the weeds. The XRP token, Ripple's native token, is explicitly stated on the Ripple Labs website as having been developed to facilitate large-scale payments and become a major global reserve currency. They are adamant about XRP becoming the premier cryptocurrency reserve asset. In addition, Ripple's CEO has said that the underlying technology of XRP will guarantee the cryptocurrency's continuing growth regardless of price. He notes that XRP's true value remains veiled, suggesting that the public's perception of its worth might not reflect its actual potential despite the fact that major financial players like Western Union and other prestigious institutions are entering the Ripple XRP ecosystem to streamline large cross-border transactions. Although fluctuations in value are to be anticipated, I have repeatedly argued that XRP's relatively stable value may be the result of market manipulations by these very institutions in an effort to discourage you from obtaining XRP. In light of the recently implemented regulation on the classification of XRP sales, the lower the cost of acquiring XRP will be for them. These companies are required to acquire XRP from Ripple as a security. This need will push them to engage in price fixing in public marketplaces in an effort to maximize their profit margins. Keep in mind that this concerns not just household names like Western Union. An even more fascinating discovery emerged when I studied the BRICS countries and their increased participation in the global economy. In case you didn't catch the previous episode, though, let's start from the beginning. After conducting some research, I discovered that the BRICS countries are all connected to the Ripple network as they prepare to introduce a unified digital currency supported by their central banks. I recommend checking out my Twitter if you're interested in learning more. Since BRICS refers to the five developing economies of Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa, let's jump right into Brazil's key features. Ripple just launched its on-demand liquidity service in Brazil, a significant step in the crypto space's expansion into Russia. The president of the country has stated that the falling global significance of petrodollars is a process that will not reverse itself. Several open sources indicate that Russia is working on developing a CBDC based on the XRP ledger, with Ripple being recognized as the next BRICS helping force after India. I have some shocking news, Ripple is spearheading. The charge to have banks in India issue digital rupees using the XRP cryptocurrency. To create CBDC on the Ripple platform, many different central banks from around the world are collaborating. And if you thought that was the end of it, think again, despite China's strong position against cryptocurrencies, evident from the restriction implemented in 2018, the country has joined up with Ripple to establish a CBDC based on the XRP ledger. It's noteworthy that the BRICS countries have embarked on this path, despite their initial skepticism about cryptocurrencies due to their close association with Ripple and the linked cryptocurrency XRP. As an example, 
take Ripple's introduction into the Chinese market through its partnership with Lion Lion, a big multinational bank based in Hong Kong. This is a very significant development, considering China's continued efforts to restrict Bitcoin activity within its borders. South Africa is another key player. In the African blockchain study, the BRICS group's collaboration with Ripple is front and center. Over 13 African countries' monetary systems have reportedly adopted XRP. A recent cooperation between Ripple and a business called Proper Home has been lauded as a game-changer in the real estate industry, one of the many that Ripple intends to disrupt. Ripple's eventual goal is to tokenize rental homes and other forms of real estate. Doing some additional digging on this outside of the realm of Ripple's, I uncovered what could be really important data for the XRP community. XRP's value may be greatly increased if this connection were used to facilitate direct XRP usage. While the current price of XRP is just about 50 cents, the groundbreaking technology and unparalleled cross-border payment capabilities it offers make this a very essential cryptocurrency regardless of the price. There's a chance that XRP's genuine value is far higher than its stock price right now. Please keep in mind that I am not a trained financial expert. These videos are meant for entertainment purposes only. I always encourage my audience to do their own research and consult professionals before making any major financial decisions. Thank you very much for hearing us out. Show your appreciation for the video by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing. If you turn on push notifications, you'll be among the first to know when I post something new. See you later, bye.